Hello and welcome back to another episode of Jensen Industries here on the uh, channel. Yes, channel. That's the word. Uh, I'm I'm terribly sorry that the two previous episodes were actually two episodes. I thought I only recorded enough for one episode, but apparently I had recorded one hour, and it wasn't really that much I could edit away. But that's just the way of it. Anyway, today I'm gonna do all things a little bit different. Here's my clipboard. Currently I only have three items, the solar panels, wind turbine and a quarry. And we'll see how much time that takes and how much else, uh, what, what else we'll do once that is done. Uh, let me just show you my house. I have changed it a little bit. I can, I'll just break this and show you what's behind. It's my automated system with a macerator and furnace. And we have it, there's a furnace, there's a macerator, and there's a chest that uh, takes it all up. Currently it is working on uh, iron ore. For some reason I got wood in there. I don't know how that happened, I will have to take that out at some point. Uh, yeah, uh, that's about it. Just uh, the window there just to see in if there's anything in the system. And here is to actually access uh, the machinery. So let's get down. I change it up a little bit here as well. I got the metallurgic infuser connected to the copper cable as well. And there's the extractor. And there's the chest once again. I think I'm out of power now. Yeah, which is exactly why I'm gonna do the episode right now. Because I need power badly. So first off, we will start with the solar panels. Uh, these ones. Uh, I have everything that is required. Uh, coal power you get from, uh, well, lots of stuff. Uh, what I did, I went to the nether and got some nether coal ore. And I grinded that manually with this thing. And I got the coal dust that way. Or you can macerate it. It doesn't really matter. You get the same amount. 5 dust per ore. I think it's 3 dust per ore if you use uh, uh, the overvolt ore. Uh, okay, let's just dump some things into this chest. And you over there. And here's the uh, everything that goes through this chest ends up down here. Also a couple of things that I placed there myself. Uh, these are, well, everything that is needed in some other, well, tools and things. I use tools and stuff. Yeah. What's the, what's the word for stuff that you use in, uh, with other stuff? I've been, I've been trying to figure that out. I know I... I know the word, but I just can't process it. Ah! Anyways. Confusion powder? Okay. Anyways, this is what is required to make five solar panels. So let's take all of this and start making it. Okay. Uh, solar panel. Oh, fudge. Uh, you know what? Let's just break that cable right there. For I actually need some power for my metallurgic infuser. Uh, I think I need two of them. Let's just, mm, yeah, let's just wait for that to be done. There we have them. There's a bench, still not used to it. Okay, so, and we need a generator as well. So I need iron plate. I need eight iron plate. To get the iron plate, I need a forge hammer. I think I have the almost broken one. Yeah, there it is. There's a place, a heart of iron in there. No, that's not where it is supposed to be. And this is just stuff that I might make things out of. And so I have four. I need... I need more than eight. 
How many did I need? I need five of these. So five times five equals 25 iron plate. 25 iron plates. Uh, where's my iron? There it is. Hammer. So let's just make 25. Oh, the hammer broke. That is why I made a new one before I started recording. Uh, where did it put itself? There we go. And 10 more. There we have them. And I need. Uh, want to 20 tin item casings. Is it 10 item casings I need? Yes, it is. So I have four of them. And let's just place the hammer. How many did I need? 20? Yeah, it was 20. So let's see. And that's. Not right. Oh, that's silver. Did I miss? Oh! Okay, uh, I mistook silver for tin. My bad. So, oh, and 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. And there we have all of those. And I need some insulated cables. Uh, how many insulated cables did I need? Uh, five. I think I only need five. Did I only need five? Apparently, yes. Okay. Uh, should have everything on me. Uh, I also need this color where is it here we have it ah uh, my bad once again let's just go with three and nine and now we place the rubber just so I have a little bit this is so much crap and now let's just see here five and we have no and we should have that there is this right seriously i i i, I never remember okay redstone in the middle i'm one redstone short two redstone short in fact and Good. And lastly, and then we have five of those. And next up, we need the iron furnaces. And so I think that two and five. And lastly, to ah shit, to make the furnace, I need uh, okay. So that means I need uh, fifteen more. So I need all of those placed like so. The iron furnace is there, and the batteries are there, and I get the. No, 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 no. Was it a Do I need a generator? Yeah, okay. I just had to make completely sure that I'm not bolsing it up. And... No, that's the wrong one. Solar panel. Uh, am I missing... Am I missing something here? Uh-huh. And... The glass... Like that. And... Voila. 
what else? Oh, right. Uh huh. I guess that explains it. Uh, one, two, three, four. Wait, oh. Uh. Okay, there we have it. I also now remember something else. Landmark. We need that at one point. And there we have them. Four solar panels. Five solar panels, even. I actually wanted to make water mills. These. But 20 water mills isn't as good as five solar panels. That is extremely shameful but uh, the, 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 um, the positive side of the water mill is that it works at night time the solar panel does not which is a really real downside downer at all at best uh, also I wanted to make uh, an advanced uh, solar panel uh, the, the glass is really easy to make um, the advanced alloy is easy to make, the advanced circuit is easy to make. The irradiant rainforest plate, however, is extremely hard to make. The, sc the scenarium piece. Input, glowstone dust. Output, scenarium piece, energy, 1 million. I need a mole mole molecular transformer. Let's just take a look at the molecular transformer. Uh, molecular... Holy shit! Holy shit! Are you seeing this? Yeah, so just to make an advanced solar panel, I need that. It requires all of this. Holy crap, that's a lot. Anyways, uh, let's make my way to the top here. I'm gonna... I need some st stone. Okay, I'll see you up on the roof in a moment. Okay, here we are on the roof. I think I'll have it here. Okay, so right here we can start. Yeah. Should I just. Oh, no. Let's see. And it will go. Like that, ooh, another. Like that, I guess. And then we will have them up there like that. And I think, I don't think they uh, connect to each other like this. I think they need to be connected with a, with a cable. I am not 100% sure about that. So let's just do it like this. And that, and make it come down that can actually be removed uh, any creepers nearby? no creepers nearby and we'll have it come down like there I'll fix that later You can actually hear my what's it called my portal buzzing down there it's a little bit annoying but it doesn't bother it's not that annoying when, when they run up above see I want it to come in via from this location and good should have enough cables and voila uh, no 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 I need to move that I do grab my wrench okay and there we go now let's turn on those are they working yes do I get more than I'm using 
No, I am not. I am using more than I'm gaining at the moment. So I will have to make a couple more. Wait, am I? It's not that easy to tell. No, I'm losing more than I'm gaining right now. So that means I'll have to get more uh, solar panels in the future. Or I might just get them now off screen. And changing cables will also work because... I'm losing power for each cable I'm using. So I should, I should actually be getting much more, but these are the only cables I'll be able to use for now, unfortunately. Anyways, uh, now let's make something else. Uh, the quarry and... What's it called? A windmill. So let's take these first. I think that's for the windmill. Uh, not windmill, wind turbine. So I need osmium ingots and a basic something. So let's make another basic something. I, I didn't mean to place it there. And what else do I need? I need enriched alloy. I think I have that already, yes. Uh, to make it, you just use the metallurgy infuser with an iron ingot. It was the first thing I made with the ingot, uh, with the infuser, uh, by accident. Okay, so now I have the circuit uh, enriched alloy osmium. So I need four more enriched alloys. Uh, one, two, three, four. There we have them. So one, two, and there. I think. Yes. They do not stack, unfortunately. Wait, what? I don't have enough. Oh, I see. Hmm. Let's just try and do it manually then. And there we have the wind turbine suite. Now, lastly, we are gonna make. Is there anything up there now? No. Place it, Tinor. Uh, lastly, we will have the quarry. Just have it ready. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Of these. Didn't I? I never have enough, do I? Seven. And let's see. Iron gear. So I need seven stone. Which then turns to seven iron. I need four gold, which then will have to be turned into two diamond gears. Whew. And I need a diamond pickaxe. So I think it's something like this. No, almost. And we have ourselves a quarry. Oh, let's just sleep. And it's a new morning. So we have all of these. Now we just need the landmarks. They should be quite easy to make. I think it's Lapis Lazuli combined with a redstone torch. Uh, landmark. Yes, it is indeed. And I should, yes, uh, I think I only need three. Yeah, I should only need three of them. Uh, I'm going to use the landmarks to uh, map out a large area that I'm going to uh, dig out with a quarry. One, two, three. There you have them. 
Okay. You're actually gonna make one thing more with the diamonds. Do I have glass on me? No, it should be here. Yes. I need some diamond pipes. And I can also make me some chests. You know what? I'll see you in just a moment where I'm gonna build my quarry. Okay, so I placed the markers. Uh, as you can see, the red line uh, is the area that I'll hopefully mine out with my uh, quarry here. Let's just pick that up. It, but when I place it down here, it should... There we go. Sweet. Now, I think the wind turbine is bugged in this version. I am not sure, but I believe it is. Because, oh, sorry about that burp. It is moving at a ridiculous rate. And by ridiculous, I mean it is fast. Now the wind turbine should move quicker the higher up in the air it is. So, oh, I'm not gonna plunk it out just yet. Um, so let's do it. I'm uh, just gonna dig a hole here. That should do it. And here I'm gonna place one of these. And one up. Yeah, let's just go one up. Uh, I didn't think this one through it. I didn't. And uh, let's just... Take all of these. And uh, where are they? Here we have them. Place you there. Please let there be no creeper nearby. I hate it when a creeper comes to blow up my uh, shit. So there, there's a reason why I'm building it so far from my home, which is over there, 160 meters away. Is because I installed Galactic Craft and another mod after I settled down. So those ores are not over at my original uh, home, unfortunately. Which is why I'm setting it up over here and I will get all that I require. Now let's right click here, which is going down, black. Uh, so in black. We will have dirt, cobblestone, and gravel. So let's power this beauty. Just making sure there aren't any creepers nearby. And there it goes. So this is gonna take a long time, uh, which is why I got a server set up, yes. So I'm just gonna skip the creation of the quarry and we'll see how it goes in just a little while. Okay, here it goes. Now it ha there's something over there that I haven't put in. Yeah, those things. I, I might keep them. Let's just see what it is. You can see all the stones goes down there, which is my bin. Can I break that even more? No. Let's just, let's just break it once more, just to make sure that it actually goes down. Okay. Good. So my quarry now works, and... For me to actually have this loaded when I'm not offline, yes, uh, I think I didn't mention that I'm on a server, private server that is. I need I to either stay online and hide myself in a hole nearby to keep the chunks loaded, or I need a chunk loader. What is this granite used for? Uh, okay. Well, I think I'll keep it. Now, the downside with this system. It's gonna spread in all chests. Yes, that can be a problem, really. 
I guess I just have to come and uh, fix it a little bit later. For example, I can use this one to send granites to one chest along with uh, some other stuff. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Well, this is crap. Hmm. I'll just have to sit here and wait a little bit. Okay, I took the time to make two more windmills. They're extremely cheap to make. But if they are bugged, I won't be using them in anywhere else besides my quarry. Because, well, it's cheap to use something that's bugged. Uh, I need to uh, reroute my... Uh, uh, these things. Uh, shit. Fudge. What the fuck? There we go. What just happened here? Uh, that's not gonna work. This isn't gonna work at all. Uh, okay, well, it's only dirt coming right now, so I need to make it come around like this. Let's just break you. There we go. It's it's a long it's a it's not exactly ideal, but it is all I have to work with. And like that. Look at it go. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Mm. This is gonna take a while. I'm just gonna jump down there and remove some foliage myself well i think that's gonna do it for today we've been going on about for 27 minutes yeah so in the next episode the quarry will be dug out and i will have lots of other things on my agenda so thank you guys i hope you enjoyed it until next time bye